This week we saw the release of High Evolutionary and this was one of the cards I was most excited to get. The reason for my excitement was that this card allows you to play a whole new way and I think that's pretty neat. If you don't already know, High Evolutionary unlocks the potential of your cards with no abilities at the start of the game. Those abilities are as follows. Wasp, afflict two random enemy cards here with minus one power. Misty Knight, when you end a turn with unspent energy, give another friendly card plus one power. Shocker, on reveal, give the leftmost card in your hand minus one cost. Cyclops, when you end a turn with unspent energy, afflict two random enemies here with minus one power. Thing, on reveal, afflict a random enemy card with minus one power, repeat this twice more. Abomination, costs one less for each enemy card in play that's afflicted with negative power. And lastly, Hulk, ongoing, plus two power for each turn you ended with unspent energy. So now that I had the card, I was thinking of decks to try, and while I did come up with some decent stuff, a viewer in my chat, Raxius, had a much better idea for a deck. This is what he came up with, and I couldn't have been happier to jump in the games to try this beast out. The idea of the deck is to reduce your opponent's power with Wasp and Cyclops while reducing the cost of Abomination in the process. If the opportunity arises, we can copy our good cards in hand with Moon Girl for extra fun, and we can finish off the game by playing Luke Cage with Hazmat or slamming a big fat Hulk on the board. While this deck is very fun to play, it can sometimes be a royal pain when facing the mirror since Luke Cage will obviously negate the power reduction you try to apply. Overall though, it's a really fun deck. We climbed a few ranks with it, and I think once more playtesting is done with High Evo, the better the decks will get over time. That's just a given. So thanks again to Raxius for the deck, and if you want to come by and give me your ideas or suggestions, well, you're in luck because I am streaming Snap on Twitch 4 days a week from Monday to Thursday, starting around 7pm Eastern Standard Time, so if you can, come on over. Lastly, before we get into the games, I just want to thank you guys so much for watching, and if you enjoy this kind of content and you want more, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel to help it grow, and to get this video out to more people. Until next time. Well, we're starting off strong with the, uh, with the Sunspot too. And he got buffed. Now we're actually gaming. Okay, this guy's also a high evo gamer. Cloning vats. You know what we could do, actually? We could just pop Scorpion in there. And just keep reducing his cards. This might be enough to, like, push him off and leave. Very possible. Everyone's favorite dream dimension actually not play this and juice up the sunspot a bit okay so he's gonna do kind of the same thing now problem is if he has Luke cage this is all for naught right so I guess we'll see what happens it also do this as well I did, I evolved again. I got rid of my Shetty deck and I played Raxius' deck because his is way better. And I don't know how to fucking, how to make a deck to save my life. Okay, there's our Luke Cage. I think I'm just gonna play this and then next turn we just Luke Cage Hazmat and then see where, what happens from there. It's clobbering time. Slap, slap, and slap. I love the animations of that, by the way. Holy shit, it's so good. Like, they really killed it on the animations for this. Okay, we just do this, and then I guess we could play... Another one of these here. That's all we can really do, I think. Or maybe we just play it over here. Let's see. He might be doing the same thing, though. Yeah, he's got the same thing. Oh, wait, but he doesn't have the hazmat. But he did. Oh, we just no, but I win because of the uh, thing because of of Dark Dimension. No, I lose. Maybe. Oh, I won by one. OK, cool. Great. I hate... I can't do math. This deck is surprisingly good. Thanks to your big brain, Raxius. And plus, knowing that it was bounce, it was a lot easier to play Cage out there a little bit earlier. These people do be running a little bit of uh, of Rogue now that he's kind of a thing. Also, Trixillion coming in kind of clutch with Jeff. Thank you. The biggest thing is my dick. <laughs> big dick, big brain. Big brain. 
That is not fun at all. Oh, we got leader? Oh my god. Okay, well, we can secure this lane at least. That's kind of nice. And we have Abomination, so maybe we can just pull the... Uh, we can just pull this combo now. And then we can have... Maybe a le we can do maybe Leader and Abomination next. Just cause. Okay, goodbye leader. We can't have leader. That's unfortunate. I don't think this is too bad though. I think we just do this. We play the abomination and the cyclops and I sh think we sh we should be okay. Yeah, we can move Jeff right. That's a good idea. Yeah, there's no risk there. We could also just play the Quinjet too. Yeah, yeah, we just do that. Let's hope for the best. Does he have it? Chavez. So that was the free card that he got. Stature. Hey, look at that. And then Cyclops said, no, get out of here. Slapped him. Let's go. Gaming. Uh oh, it's hoo-ha. Shit. Oh, and we got rocks. Let's go. No, you got him, Hagrid. More like Dank Dimension? Tell me about it. Tell me about it. Actually, though. Oh, one drop. All right, let's play it and pump. Pumpity pump pump. Your cat stole your soup? That's unfortunate. But to be fair, I'd probably steal it too. I mean, soup. Soup is good. Soup, very good. Might be safe to just play loot cage now. I don't know though. I could just play it next turn. And then on five, I could use a Spider-Man. Might just do that. Oh, he also has loot cage. So basically our stuff has just gone to shit now. Might as just well play this for power, I guess. Or you know what I could do is just get the She-Hulk out now. Yeah, I think I'll do that. Damn, I should have played it over there like I wanted. Not very smart. Guess we can lock this up, hopefully. What else does he have there? Okay, Reality Stone. Okay, that's fine, so we can do that. Now, I guess we just put here this for pure power. Let's see if this works. I don't know. <clears throat> oh, he left. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. It feels like I'm kind of a little underwhelmed in a way. If that makes any sense. And just play the sunspot here. Horn hub. Oh, he gave us a Doc Ock. Let's go. That might not be entirely bad. Slap. Oh, you know what we could do? We could just play this for power mid. 
It's a lot of power. Oh, now we can just actually full pass. I think we just do that. We can juice the sunspot. <clears throat> nice Gamora. I have Pryo, huh? Okay. Well, it doesn't hurt to put this here either way. One extra power never hurts. 12 and 6. Hey, look at that. We won a game. Nice. I think that uh, Doc Ock coming out of Pornhub there was actually kind of clutch. Not going to lie. Gave us a lot of power mid and nothing that he could do to deal with it. <clears throat> 